An office turf war battle is resolved for now, but there are still some very real problems that need to be addressed in the Struthers City Hall. 27 First News reporter Amanda Smith takes a look at the problems that unfolded this morning. Struthers maintenance supervisor Don Clyde had a nasty surprise waiting for him at work on Monday morning. They broke the one frame of my kids' pictures. Acting on orders from Judge Dominic Leone, the court staff emptied out Clyde's office. All my stuff, everything was swept out of my office and placed in the hallway. There's um, police tape, you know, blocking the way to my hallway. There's no way I can get my work done. Here's why. Leon has been upgrading security in the court. There's a new video security system. Metal detectors are more prominent. And Leon needs space for the newly created probation department. The city was trying to move Clyde's office downstairs and then move probation into Clyde's space. But that was apparently taking too long for the judge, who basically had Clyde evicted. I responded to him and told him that I'm not going to remove any mess. Um, obviously, you created the mess. I think it would be up to your staff. In a letter, Leon says he disagrees with the mayor's rundown of events and said the court has spent months trying to work with the mayor to make space for female inmates and the probation department. The fire chief got involved and said someone needed to move the stuff out of the hallway and fast. We're working with the judge right now to remedy the situation um, in an amicable manner that um, both sides can agree to and do it promptly. Chief Simcox said the stuff blocked the fire extinguishers and the exits. If the city couldn't reach a solution, he recommended the building be shut down until the safety hazards were clear. Now late this morning, that impasse came to an end when city firefighters came down and cleared away all of the desks and cabinets that were blocking the hallways. The judge also issued an order requiring the city set up the space needed. In Struthers, Amanda Smith, WKBN 27 First News.